Hello YouTube and thanks for tuning in to Spankle Vision and we are back again with another episode of Minecraft Tutorials and today we're going to be checking out the elephant. This is another um, animal in the zoo tutorial series and if you haven't seen the zoo epic structure tour I'll put a link in the description of this video and a link to the animal playlist so you can check them all out. But this is one of my favorites um, right up there with a the giraffe. Uh, it's really easy too. So to get started, oh, we're going to need some black wool. There we go. So you're going to need gray wool, stone brick slab, gray carpet, button, quartz slab, and black wool. So what you'll do first is you're going to lay down your gray wool, take a space, take two space, lay another gray wool and space there. That'll be the base of his feet. And then you're going to stack one, two, three, one, two, three, and the fourth one. This is, you're going to find the front. Make sure this is going to be the front of your elephant. One, two, three, and the fourth one will be black wool and you're going to connect put a piece of gray wool there there and there don't go to the leaf two right there in the front and same thing on the back here just go up one two three four just like you did in the front but just no no need to put a black one there and then we're going to connect these i'll put his ears on next that'll be good so Behind the black right there, you're gonna place a block, a gray block. Same thing on this side, you're gonna place a gray block and then a second gray block and then a block there. And so we'll do the same thing here. Two out and then there. So you're looking like that right now. And then you're gonna put your stone brick half slabs right there in the middle. And we're gonna put another one, two, oops, three, four right there going back and then you're gonna get your gray carpet put on top of the black go ahead and put your eyes on with the buttons <clears throat> and this is we're almost done with the front here so right here below the eyes you're gonna put two out and, and then that will we'll pause right there for a minute with that let's finish up his body we'll come back and finish the rest of them so in the back as you can see it's gonna step down one and then you're gonna have this go down two and then come out two as well oh wait oops no that's not right or is it what do I do here oh no yes that is correct forgot how to make it it's been a while so then you're gonna step out two as the as well right there so and then on the sides he's puffed out Go one here, and you're gonna pull that back to right there to his legs, and then do the same thing, but only go leave a little a little space there in the front. That's what I did. So I'm gonna go back four on the top, and then three there, and then when you fill in the inside here, just fill it up like so. Put two in the middle there, and Fill that up and then we're gonna put half slabs but we're in the back here you're gonna pull those out and then you're gonna we'll do the half slab trick oops oh, I can't get under there you want one there there you go like that there's this little elephant tail so there's what the back looks like as you can see just like over here now in the front um, we're almost done. It's real easy. We'll put the trunk on first. So you'll put a half slab, another half slab, half slab, another half slab, half slab, another half slab, and then stack that one. So that's just a little trunk coming out. And then to do these, you're going to start under the eye, go to the bottom of it for his tusk. And we're going to have to break them as we go. So you can do that one. There you go. And you do the same thing on this side. It's just going to go out three. Oops. Well, how did I get that one? Oh, yeah, I broke that one too soon. There we go. So that's it. That's an elephant. Oh, wait. Put his, uh, that's right. I put these for his big toes. Elephants have big toes. So I just put some just around the three sides just to give them a little bit more a little bit more definition a little more detail 
And I believe that's it now. Do we get this side? Nope. There we go. Now he's a completed elephant and he's awesome. Um, you could probably enlarge it maybe if you if you wanted like larger size. It probably wouldn't be hard to fine tune this and maybe even slightly smaller one. So this should definitely help out any zoo or wildlife or like circus type thing you're making. And hopefully you guys enjoyed. As always, I do appreciate you watching and we will see you guys next time. Thanks a lot.